Welcome back everyone. You may be in a situation where for some reason your Apple Pencil is just not working. Now this can happen for a couple of different reasons as always. The first thing I'd recommend doing though is to actually make sure that your Apple Pencil was actually being charged in the first place. So whether you have the first gen or the second gen, you want to go ahead and place it next to the actual iPad or plug it into the iPad as you normally would and you want to see if that actually ends up charging the Apple Pencil. If your iPad discovers your Apple Pencil, then you can pretty much rest assured that it's charging and there's probably not an issue with the pencil itself or the iPad and that's a really good thing. However, if your Apple Pencil is not discovered by your iPad, well that is a problem in and of itself. You may want to go ahead and try connecting it again. Maybe you're not plugging it into the right side. You may want to try either you know reconnecting your Apple Pencil or you want to try another iPad that you may have, plug it into that device and see if it charges. If it isn't discovered by any of those other Apple products you have, well that Apple Pencil may have a problem and you may want to go ahead and send it to Apple for repair. However, if it's being discovered but it's just not writing anything, in this specific situation, you want to look at the tip of the Apple Pencil. Now these tips are actually removable, so sometimes you may have to buy another tip for the Apple Pencil to actually go ahead and you know have it fixed. So what you want to do is you basically want to unscrew that tip of that Apple Pencil, or you want to go ahead and tighten that up by screwing it the other way. So go ahead, tighten that you know tip up, and you want to go ahead and you know press it onto the Apple Pencil against the iPad display and you want to see if it works then. A majority of the time this will probably end up fixing it. If you just need to tighten that tip up, that's pretty much it. Sometimes the tip may actually be, you know, fully carved out and you may have to get another tip installed. So you may want to go ahead and purchase another tip. I'll leave some in the description below. So you want to go ahead and purchase those tips, screw it back into the bottom of that specific Apple Pencil and you should be good to go for the most part here. So that's pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.